This is how we draw a ray diagram to show how a reflection appears in the mirror. This is our object, which is a red arrow drawn from A to B. The first thing we do is to find the perpendicular distance that the object is from the mirror. So we take a ruler and we measure from A to the mirror is about 6 cm. And therefore, the image of A must also be 6 cm away from this surface. Do take note that we measure 6 cm from the point at which the reflection hits the mirror. We do not measure 6 cm from the back of the shaded line or the back of the mirror. So starting from here, we measure another perpendicular distance of 6 cm from this mirror and that will give us a total of 12 cm. So the image of A will be found here and we will call this A prime. We have to show our working so we will do some faint dotted lines to show our working and then we draw a perpendicular line here. Now we do the same for B. B, the perpendicular distance of B to the mirror is 4cm. And so the image of B should be 4cm away from the mirror. And that means we measure up to 8cm here and we draw it. And similarly, we show our working by drawing this dotted line very faintly to show your teacher how you obtain this result. After that, we are going to draw the light rays from the image to the eyes. And since the eyeball has two corners, we will draw two light rays to show how the light travels to the two extremes of the eyeballs. So let's do for A prime first. First, you join this line to the edge of the eyeball and you draw a straight line until you reach the mirror. Now take note, once you reach the mirror, you have to do dotted lines because the light rays behind the mirror are not real. They are virtual. So this is what we do. After that, you join up point A prime to the other corner of the eyeball and similarly draw a straight line followed by dotted lines. The next step is to join this point where the light ray touches the mirror to the object itself. So I'm joining the first point to A and the second point to A. The final step is to draw the light rays. Since light travels from A to the mirror, we will draw the arrows this way. And then from the mirror to the eyes, we're going to draw the arrow this way. Do take note that you should not draw any arrows on this dotted line because this is a virtual image. And so light does not actually shine from the image to the eyes. So there's no light rays here. Now we're going to repeat this process for B. So following the same thing, we can take B and join it to the eyes. And we draw a straight line up to the mirror, followed by dotted lines up to B. Next, we take another straight line from the other corner of the eye, followed by dotted lines. Then we join up the point where the line hits the mirror to B. And we fill in the arrows to show how light travels. So finally, we will join up AB to form the final image that you see.
And that is how you find the reflection in the mirror and how you draw the ray diagrams to show how you can see this reflection.